Prince Harry's tell-all memoir Spare has the backing of 47% of British people compared to 10% who think he should not publish it, according to exclusive polling for Newsweek. The Duke of Sussex's long-awaited book is due to be published by Penguin Random House on January 10, 2023, and will, according to the press release, be full of insight, revelation, self-examination, and hard-won wisdom about the eternal power of love over grief. British commentators have long been speculating about whether it will renew criticism of the monarchy as an institution and also of royal family members after the bombshells of Harry and Meghan Markle's 2021 Oprah Winfrey interview. Some have called for the Duke to bury the book out of respect for Queen Elizabeth II, who passed away in September, while others have called for Harry and Meghan to be stripped of their royal titles over it. However, British people appear far less concerned about Harry's decision to release his life story, with support for publication far outstripping his own personal approval rating. A survey of 1,500 UK adults by Redfield Wilton for Newsweek conducted on October 30 showed 47% of Brits support Harry writing and publishing the book. This included 26% who strongly supported the move and 21% who supported it, compared to 10% who opposed the decision, including 6% who strongly opposed it. Recent polling by YouGov during the third quarter of 2022 found 38% of British people liked Prince Harry while 37% disliked him, giving him a net approval rating of plus one. The two sets of data suggest that even some people who dislike Harry may still support him publishing the book, in spite of their reservations about the royal. The research has implications for the royal family's reputation management and how they respond to the memoir if it contains new bombshells. The title hints at Harry's fraught relationship with his brother and his standing within the royal family, as it is derived from his own status as the spare second son, waiting on the substitute bench in case the heir, Prince William, should pass away or abdicate. Royalists, commentators and even palace press officers, may instinctively want to defend any new criticisms on the basis royals have the right to expect private matters within the family should remain secret. However, Newsweek's data appears to suggest the public do not see the issue that way, and believe Harry has the right to tell his story. The book will likely also include a significant chunk of Meghan's story, and her time in the royal family, which she is already on record saying was difficult to the point she experienced suicidal thoughts in January 2019. Of particular concern may well also be how he depicts Camilla, the Queen Consort, who became his stepmother in the years after Princess Diana died. Richard Kay, a journalist and former friend of Diana's, wrote in his Daily Mail column in August, Understandably there is considerable anxiety in Buckingham Palace circles that Harry, 37, will use the memoir to settle perceived scores with family members and senior courtiers. They are particularly nervous about his attitude towards his stepmother, the Duchess of Cornwall, the woman who many of the late princess supporters still blame for the collapse of the Charles Diana marriage. Penguin Random House's press release said, Spare takes readers immediately back to one of the most searing images of the 20th century, two young boys, two princes, walking behind their mother's coffin as the world watched in sorrow and horror. As Diana, Princess of Wales, was laid to rest, billions wondered what the princes must be thinking and feeling, and how their lives would play out from that point on. For Harry, this is his story at last. With its raw, unflinching honesty, Spare is a landmark publication full of insight, revelation, self-examination, and hard-won wisdom about the eternal power of love over grief. The British public's view on Prince Harry's memoir Newsweek asked, Prince Harry will be publishing a tell-all memoir about his life growing up and living in the UK royal family. To what extent, if at all, do you support or oppose Prince Harry writing and publishing this book? Strongly support 26% support 21% neither support nor oppose 33% oppose 4% strongly oppose 6% don't know 10%.